changing the way they grade restaurant inspections. It happened back in March. And starting last month, small posters or placards with letter grades became available if the restaurants choose to take them. Well, they're now popping up all over San Antonio, but there are exceptions. Here's Mark Austin with Behind the Kitchen Door follow-up reports. The day crew at this Freddy's Frozen Custard is minutes away from opening for the day in Alamo Ranch. A health inspector was here just weeks ago, gave them a perfect score, and offered them this, a placard to showcase their perfect score to customers. General Manager Sebastian Elizondo didn't hesitate to take it. There, you know, uh, they see it when they pick up their food. So, yes, it is, it's very noticeable and, and it's very good. Dr. Hell says they're happy to see the placard program is taking off. Plus, I believe that as the public sees placards in more restaurants, the public are going to begin asking the facilities that they routinely dine at about their placards. The signs are not required and some restaurants don't want them at all. In the first week of June, Metro Health says they inspected 255 establishments. 156 took the grade A placard, only four took the B placard. And of all the restaurants that were offered placards during that period, how many took the C placard? None. San Antonio restaurants that get C's can ask for private consultations. The health department will eventually offer classes to poor performers that will focus on the recipe for success. Even if they only embrace one or two parts of the total program, they have to do better. Back at Freddy's, multiple checklists keep the staff on task and the restaurant clean. They'd like to keep these coming. It's more noticeable, okay? So um, that tells uh, the public that we take pride in our work. With Behind the Kitchen Door, Mark Austin, KSAT 12 News. If you want to see the story again or other stories Mark has done on San Antonio restaurants, you can go to KSAT.com, click on the news tab, and look for behind the kitchen door. Tomorrow on Good Morning San Antonio, Mark reveals more perfect scores from around town.